Good. We're going to get this started. I know you're tight on time, so we'll run through some uh, questions real fast here. Let's start with James Kripia from the Oregonian. Ryan, just wanted to ask you, uh, last year the O-line did a really, really good job against uh, Weaver and Hamilcar in those games of just kind of isolating them, preventing them from uh, really creating much by any way of disruption. Uh, without giving any way, uh, way anything, how do you try to do that, whether it's with Rodgers or Woods in particular, how do you try to replicate that this weekend? Yeah, those guys are both really good players, and uh, their defense as a whole is really good. They fly around. They play fast. They're physical. Um, I don't think we're going to do anything in particular, but we'll run our stuff, and we'll execute it to the best of our ability, and I think that gives us a good chance to win and be successful on Saturday. Eric Scopel, 247 Sports. I know you said a couple of weeks ago when we talked to you, you're not for you're not doing it for Attaboys, but it must feel pretty good to be named to the uh, PFF national team and also the Pac-12 Offensive Lineman of the Week. Uh, can you kind of reflect on what that meant for you? Yeah, I mean, of course, it's an honor. Um, a lot of great players across the country. Uh, really thankful to the coaches for getting me ready this week. The scout team guys, they did a great job giving us a good look, got us ready. Um, and the guys I play next to, you know, Alex Forsyth, Sala. Steven, all those guys, you know, they really make my job a lot easier. And so just going out and executing uh, our technique and our fundamentals. And uh, I mean, at the end of the day, the ultimate goal is to win the game. And that's what we did. And so we'll try and do that again this week. Ryan Thorburn, Register Guard. Ryan, obviously, uh, you grew up in Eugene and going to Oregon games. And you've been waiting in the wings for several years to get that moment. What were your emotions like? Uh, getting the start at Autzen, and, and did you have butterflies, or were you kind of prepared for that? Uh, I felt like I was pretty prepared. You know, the coaches did a great job preparing all of us throughout the week um, for what we were going to see on Saturday and then what the atmosphere was going to be like. It uh, wasn't exactly like I envisioned it when I was a kid. You know, the stadium was a little bit empty, but other than that, you know, it was, it was a lot of fun just to be out there with the guys and uh, to get the win. Jerry Thompson, Ducks Illustrated. Yeah, Ryan, so what do you think you, you did the best or in your performance and what did you need to improve on? Were you a little surprised on getting the honor? Uh, yeah, I think there's a lot of things we can improve on. You know, uh, Coach Mirabal is always going to harp on the stuff that we need to improve on um, because, you know, like he says, uh, you know, what we did last week is not going to help us this week. You know, last week's gone. This is a new week. So there's a lot of things we can improve on uh, as personally, individually, as an offensive line and as an offense, you know, we feel like we left a lot out there and we'll look to improve on that this week. Uh, Eric Scopel. Ryan, you can correct me if I'm wrong here, but you played left and right guard on Saturday, correct? Yes. Uh, was it strange or difficult moving between those spots throughout the game and kind of reflect upon maybe if you felt more comfortable either one? No, uh, Coach Mirabal, I mean, like I said, uh, last time I talked to you guys, Coach Mirabal did a great job of during camp. He really moved us around and I mean, I was, I was being serious when uh, I said that, you know, he moved us around all the time and we were getting a lot of reps at different spots. And so it really just felt like practice uh, to me, at least. I think a lot of the guys can reflect on that and probably say the same thing. Um, you know, we're moving around, getting different rotations in, and it's good to keep guys fresh like that. James Krepia. Ryan, even as the offense was uh, slightly more balanced, I guess, overall uh, this past game, you guys still had that run first mentality, uh, particularly on uh, P and 10, first and 10, still really strong run numbers. How good was that to see as an offensive lineman? How much pride do you take in that where that was still the approach, including against a Stanford team? We, I mean, you guys had never run for that kind of production against Stanford in a long, long time. Yeah, I think, I think regardless of the opponent, we want to try and be physical up front. And I think we did a pretty good job of that. But Obviously, like Coach Mirabal's talked about, we can still improve. There's a lot of room for improvement, and we'll look to attack that this week and see if we can get better. Ryan Thorburn. Ryan, uh, what are you seeing from Washington State's defense, especially their front? Um, obviously, they have a new coaching staff this year. Uh, their front, they're really fast, really twitchy. Uh, a couple big, strong interior guys. Um, great, great pass rushers, really. And they do a lot of different stuff in the past game, uh, blitz-wise. They bring some exotic stuff. And so, I mean, it'll be a great challenge for us this week to try and pick that stuff up and keep the pocket clean. Jerry Thompson. Yeah, Ryan, did you get any uh, congratulations from maybe a former uh, Sheldon quarterback in the NFL or any uh, offensive lineman from the Ducks in the NFL? 
Uh, yeah, yeah. A couple of those guys texted me. Uh, Justin texted me last Saturday uh, after I was given the scholarship and he just said congratulations. And I mean, it means a lot coming from him, you know, everything that he's done here at Oregon and everything he continues to do in the NFL, you know, he, uh, he knows, he knows what it means to be a great player at the college level and now at the professional level. So to hear it come from him and then all the guys that came before me, you know, it was really an honor. Um, yeah. I just look to keep doing it each week. That's all we have for you, Ryan. Appreciate it. Thank you.